Hello. Hello. Hello, my shoes off. No, leave your shoes on. We're going to the store. Hey guys, and welcome to the vlog. It is afternoon already because we are, I just picked up Hudson. It is one o'clock, a little after one o'clock. And um, instead of going to pick up McLean right now, we are going to run to the store. We're meeting my dad um, to pick up the birthday cake. Oh, I probably shouldn't have said that. Um, for my mom's surprise thing. I don't want to say the words. I don't want him repeating them because we're going to see my mom later. Um, but I think I've already talked about this surprise thing that we're doing for my mother tomorrow for her 60th. So we're going to pick that up, the C-A-K-E right now, and then we're going to run into the dollar store. And what are we going to get at the dollar store? Get treats. Yeah, we're going to get treats. We're going to put together our own little treasure box. So that way he does really good with the treasure box that's at school and they get stickers on their chart for doing good things and having good behavior. So we are going to have a potty training treasure box and I'm going to, he's going to get a sticker and I had said four stickers, but at school they have to get five stickers for the treasure box. So he requested five stickers. So for every time he goes pee pee or poo poo in the potty, he gets a sticker and he gets to go to the treasure box. Does that sound good? You don't look very excited. Yeah. You want to have a treasure box at home? <laughs> Box at school. Yeah, your teacher, Miss Melody, has a treasure box at school? Yeah. Yeah, so we are going to go to the dollar store, and I'm actually going to let him pick out the stuff so that hopefully he'll be even more excited about getting the treasures out of the treasure box. And, yeah, we're going to finally, he does really good at school. No accidents at school, but he's still not doing great at home. So we got to do something to just reinvigorate, re-excite, potty training, and get it done. So we can go to Disney World. You want to go to Disney World? Yeah! <laughs> yeah! I want to go to Disney World and pick out a tree. <laughs> okay. Because we have told him that he has to be potty trained. He has to be in big boy underwear to go see Mickey Mouse. Don't you? I want to go see Mickey Mouse. Yep. And we have less than a month before we go to Disney World. So, we really want him potty trained by then. He's there. He knows how to do it. He just chooses to be lazy at home. And, I mean, I'll take some of the blame I get lazy about it because after so long I just get tired of cleaning it up so we are we're not gonna go get sissy right now so we're doing the treasure box and we're going to give it another go we're gonna push mommy, really hard mommy, yes baby. I'm gonna go to Disney World. okay we're gonna go to Disney World but you got a potty train first you can't wear diapers to go see Mickey Mouse well we're not going today We're going to go see him another day. I'm going to go see him today. No, it's closed today. Anybody else tell their kids everything's closed? That's, that's what we've learned. Oh, don't start fussing. So, this is the cake. and It's kind of hard to see with the shadow, but it says, Happy 30th anniversary of your 30th birthday. And my dad ordered it. The flowers don't exactly go with our fiesta at a Mexican restaurant, but what are you going to do? <laughs> it's still cute. So that is the cake. And we have some candles. I'll show you all some of the decorations that I have later. So sweet. I've been holding her. Uh -huh. I laid her back. She went back. Hey, guys. So it is now late at night. It is 8 eight a little after eight o'clock and chase had to work late tonight so i'm here by myself the kids are down they're both asleep we stayed and had dinner at my parents house and then hudson fell asleep on the way home and i put her down shortly after we got back and now i am working on some of the last minute stuff for my mom's party tomorrow i am trying to make a photo backdrop and then I've got some other stuff i got to put together. So I thought I'd show you guys real quick what I have as far as decorations for the party. And now it's a surprise 60th birthday party. And it's going to be at a Mexican restaurant, a local Mexican restaurant on their patio. They have a big patio. So we get the whole patio to ourselves. So I didn't get a ton of stuff to decorate with. But got a few things and I thought I'd show you guys. Okay, so this is the um, photo backdrop. It's actually just a tablecloth. Oh, yeah, let's focus. Let's focus. There we go. 
Oh, it does not want to focus on that. It is just a tablecloth from Walmart, and then I got some tissue paper. I saw this on Pinterest, so I'm going to attempt. Hopefully, there's enough tissue paper in here to cover it, uh, but you kind of just cut up and make a fringe, and then just do like each row is a certain color. So we'll see if it turns out like it did on Pinterest, but it was really cute on Pinterest. And then I just got some uh, dessert plates because it's out of extra I got, so kind of with the fiesta theme the bright colors um, those are the dessert plates and then i got some candles and the birthday cake says happy 30th anniversary of your 30th birthday so i got two 30s so i figured we could put these in either corner and she could just blow out two 30s instead of a 60 because if you've seen my mom in any of vlogs she definitely does not look 60 and she does not want to be turning 60 so i thought we'd make it a little easier and have two 30s for her then at Hobby Lobby, I got uh, I got a banner, and I got a couple things. I don't know if I'm going to use all of it, but I want to have it and take it with me in case I do. This is just a happy birthday banner uh, to hang up. It's got the bright colors on it. And then I also got this little banner that's just, um, just a simple little pennants to possibly hang up. Like I said, I just, I saw these. I went ahead and got them just in case we can use them. Um, then I got some balloons to get blown up. I'm going to take them to Party City tomorrow before the party and get them blown up. Because when I looked at balloons at Party City, they were super expensive. And I didn't want to pay all that much. Then I got um, some party poppers. I got two packs of these. So it's 24 in total. And these are just the little when you pop them and the confetti comes out. And I also got some little uh, noise makers just so people can kind of have something to really kind of shout surprise and really surprise her when she comes outside. Um, for our photo booth, I have these two little sombrero hats that came from Hobby Lobby. And I'm hoping if I have time and think about it, I want to make like a little mustache on a stick, or maybe like a little speech bubble um, that says happy birthday or something people can hold up. I want a couple more photo props, but I just got to figure out what to do because in my normal fashion I've procrastinated and the party is tomorrow so I have those and then look at this this is because I originally wanted to get a sombrero and put like a happy birthday pin on it or something for my mom but then I saw this one and I think this is so cute it's a little mini sombrero it's got some feathers it's on the little headband so make sure to stick out and make sure everyone can see her um, I got some little confetti just those little pieces to put on some of the tables and I'm going to do the balloons. I'm not going to do all of these colors. I'm just going to kind of pick the main colors that we have going and I'm going to get some of these blown up and have them at the tables. So then I'll just try to put some more confetti down at the tables. Um, and then I did get the um, a 6 and O. Oh. <laughs> I said we weren't doing anything 60 but I did want to get these balloons and I saw them at Party City the big huge ones and that's what I really wanted to get. I wanted to get the big blow up ones but they were $10 each and I just didn't see spending $20 on just two balloons uh, when there was so much other stuff I wanted to get so I got these. These are from Hobby Lobby and they're 16 inches so I mean they're not huge but they're bigger than just a regular balloon. So I thought these would be cute um, just to hang somewhere. Um, I also got some Christmas stuff at Hobby Lobby. And I think, I think that's about it as far as the um, decorations go. And I'll show you. Let me see if I can show you the invitation without giving away too much personal info. Okay, so this is the invite, and I'm covering up her full name and the address of where it's at. But I love it. I found it on Etsy. And it's got the same little pennants that I got right there to hang up. And so it says, say it ain't so, June is the big 6-0. She said, a fiesta no way Shh, will surprise her anyway. And then Jordan's first surprise birthday party in honor of, and like I said, it's got her full name and the address. But isn't that the cutest little invitation? I love it. I saw it on Etsy and I just had to get it photo backdrop is complete and it turned out so good I am so happy with it I I just folded the tissue paper it's just two pieces of tissue paper folded long ways and then I cut up a little more than halfway and taped it on and then just kind of like went up higher for the next one and after I had already started and I looked back 
the one on Pinterest suggested starting at the bottom and then layering and that would be much easier because I had to flip it up to tape underneath it but I think it turned out awesome it only took me like an hour a little over an hour just sitting here watching TV cutting it as I went and I think it turned out great so I think I'm definitely going to use something kind of like this for the kids birthday parties just different colors um, because I think it's super cute and with that, I'm going to let you guys go. I am about to get ready for bed. Chase is still not home. Not sure what time he's going to make it home tonight. So I'm probably just going to go lay in bed and watch TV. Wait for him. But I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.